talk about home, I think about the cabin. We started out with a small one-room cabin that Daddy built when I was just a baby. But our family grew, and we outgrew it. So in 1990, we all got together and decided to build a bigger one. My brother Melvin drew up the blueprints on Dad's tobacco box. Everybody pitched in their time and money, and we built the cabin we have now. Since then, we've had many wonderful times there. We spend our summers there and have huge dinners every Sunday. And lots of weenie and marshmallow roast. We had mom and dad's 50th anniversary there. And my brother's wedding. We have so much fun on holidays that at Easter we have a big Easter egg hunt for the kids and lots of fireworks on the 4th of July. We dress up like pilgrims and Indians for Thanksgiving and have so much fun in such a feast. And best of all, we have Santa Claus for Christmas. But our cabin is not only for family, we have lots of friends and we welcome everyone. We had a church group of about 20 people stay there for two weeks one summer while they worked on people's homes in the community. We have kids from different colleges come for fun days and we play games with them like the clothes bag game. Booga and shaving cream battles. We've had the Kiwanis Club of War. And some of the Kellogg Leadership for Community Change and CO team. And they even performed on our Slate Creek Opera House stage. Sometimes we have impersonators like Dolly Parton, Billy Nelson, Cher, Elvis, and other look-alike celebrities, including the Soggy Bottom Boys. We have Christian worship days with singing and preaching. Once we had Hillbilly Day, and a festival to raise money to do repairs on the cabin. We have had a few pig roasts where we would roast a whole pig in a homemade roaster and invite almost the whole community. And at Christmas, we have Christmas plays. We always ask our visitors to sign our guest book, which is full of names by now. We've had guests from as close as downtown to guests as far away as Bangladesh and Africa. Everyone enjoys going four-wheeler riding. We take them on tours to a real thin and moonshine still. And a mountaintop we call the lookout, where you can see for miles and miles. There's lots of talent in their family. Some play music and sing. Some carve and whittle wood. Some are cake bakers and photographers. And most are great cooks, especially with old time recipes. We 
y'all just be yourselves. And everyone seems to like that an awful lot because they want to come back. And they always talk about how welcome we make them feel. We all enjoy spending time with family and friends. And everyone who comes to spend time with us at the Muncie's Slate Creek Cabin.